Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with a new XP farming run that I've been working on. And I'm excited to show you this because it's the fastest way to level up that I have found yet. And I have tried a lot of different things before putting this one together. And as you can see, we're going to use chain assassinations to take out pairs of enemies without being detected and looting them to pick up silver and sometimes even a rune. So this run nets 1,500 XP and also a few hundred silver. And best of all, it is repeatable. So after finishing this run, you can travel to another high point, save and reload your game and come right back here and all these guards will have respawned. This run is awesome for three reasons. Number one, you can kill two dozen enemies in a row, often without taking any damage yourself. And number two, most of the enemies are standard bearers. These guys with the big shield and spear who are worth more XP than regular enemies. So you get an XP bonus for that. And number three, almost all of the kills in this run are assassinations, which get an additional 50% XP bonus compared to non-stealth kills. And here we are just 90 seconds into this video and we're on our fourth pair of standard bearers. We've killed eight enemies and I just leveled up For some reason, now that I've leveled up, it's not going to show how much XP I'm getting for kills, but the first stealth kill is always worth 75 XP, and then when I throw the axe using the chain assassination at the second enemy, that's 50 XP for a total of 125 XP for each pair of enemies. And now the next pair of enemies is under this arch. And when I watched this video after filming it, I was shocked at how much silver I actually got from looting these guards. So this one was worth 30 silver. I just looted from the first guard. And I just picked up 25 silver from the second guard. So 55 silver from those two guards. I designed this run as an XP run, but it's also worth more silver than I expected. These are standard enemies, but I recommend you kill them because if you don't, they could detect you and cause you problems before you can get to the next pair of standard bearers. So that's kind of the whole trick to this run is trying to stay undetected so that you're not spending a lot of time in combat. You're just making the kills really quick and going from one pair of enemies to the other. And here we can use air assassination, which I love. In fact, I did a whole video on an air assassination glitch where you can keep air assassinating the same enemy over and over. I'll put a link in the description to my Assassin's Creed Valhalla playlist. So check that out if it's your first time on the channel. And here, sometimes there's a third enemy. Oh, he's there. If there's a third enemy near the pair of standard bearers, then again, you have to use air assassination to get the standard bearer before that third enemy can detect you. So now I'm going to kill all three of these enemies using stealth. So I'm going to use the chain assassination to get these two, and the third one still hasn't detected me yet, so I can assassinate him as well. One thing I should note is that this is a max level character I have here, so I don't need to use the advanced assassination skill, you know, that circle that closes and you have to do a timing-based assassination, but if you're a lower level character, you might need to use the advanced assassination to get these standard bearers. So now I'm gonna do the air assassination again on these next two guards. Oh, but there's another guard near them. 
there's a third standard bearer in front of the two I was going to kill. So I'm just going to wait and come back here later. I'm going to go take out the next pair of guards under the archways to my left. So the guards aren't always in exactly the same place, especially on the inside here. The guards near the arches are pretty much always there. So these two I can take out independently, which means I'm going to get 75 XP for each of them. And then I'm going to go back to those other guards. Oh, and the, the guy that was in front, he's now coming behind. So that means I can air assassinate those other two up here. And the other thing you'll notice, I'm not wearing my cloak. So this is not a distrust area right here. There's only certain parts of this town that are distrust areas. This is Lincoln in Lincolnshire. I'll show you the map at the end so you know exactly where I am. And now I'm going to go around and get that kind of roaming standard bearer. Most of the standard bearers are in pairs at arches or that building. There's a supply chest in that building. That's why they were guarding it, but I've already picked it up. And then there's a few of these standard bearers that are wandering by themselves. And there's usually one to this courtyard just to the left up here. So I'm going to look and see if that standard bearer is there. Another thing to watch out for is if there happen to be civilians nearby, you might have to wait a minute because, as you know, killing civilians can you know, desynchronize. And I got 30 silver again from this standard bearer. And then if you continue to the next courtyard, there's usually another single standard bearer here. There he is. And then there's two guards at that table in that house. So I'm going to chain assassinate one of them right here. But then the other one, I actually have to kill. So this is, I think, the only kill that's not stealth. And I'm just taking him out with my daggers. I think that's the only time I don't use the hidden blade. All the other kills are with stealth. And then here I am at my last two standard bearers here in Lincolnshire, who I'll kill with chain assassination. And 25 silver from that guy. So that's the end of the run here in Lincoln. And then you need to, if you want to continue and do it again, you need to fast travel to a different high point outside the region, save and reload. So I'm picking the church in Gloucestershire because as you'll see, there are another pair of guards right below the high point. One of them is a standard bearer, so I can get another quick stealth kill. But if you have another high point that you want to go to... So here's my last pair of enemies in this run, a standard bearer and then a normal enemy. And again, I got silver. And so this is a continuous run, You'll need to save and reload. I like to quick save using the down arrow on the D-pad. Or if you want to combine this with another run and maybe pick up iron or titanium, that's also a good idea. So let's take a look at the map so you can see exactly where I was. I'm in Gloucestershire at the church right now, and I started out in Lincoln at the church there. All those guards I just killed in Lincoln will respawn after I save, reload, and fast travel back here. So thanks for watching. This is Amber. Subscribe to my channel for more guides and gameplay for Assassin's Creed Valhalla.